guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Nah, I'm playing. Alright, so you just got scammed out of $80 by purchasing a bunch of fucking gunner presets, and you're trying to make your music or whatever, and you're like, damn, I like this, but like, fuck, the track sounded mad empty, bro, like my soul. You're like, shit, oh, oh no, like, my track is ass. You can't have an empty ass track, bro. You want to feel like you have a soul. So, this is what, <laughs> Jesus Christ, I really need to start writing scripts. This has been a highly requested tutorial. I always get people in my DMs like, Bro, like, closet, like, how the fuck do you, uh, fucking do the harmonies, bro? Like, I need the sauce, man. Please give me the sauce. Today is finally the day you've all been waiting for. This is probably the most sauce spilling I've ever done on this channel so far. Here's the thing. Everyone be making tutorials on, like, how to do your main vocals. But what about everything else? Because your track is not finished with just some fucking main vocals. That shit's boring as hell. A lot of people will use the term ad-libs interchangeably with harmony. That is stupid as fuck. When Travis Scott goes, it's lit! That shit is an ad-lib. But if we're looking over here at this part, this would more qualify as a harmony. It's not a fucking ad-lib. I'm telling you, no one is going to tell you this shit. In my day, I've watched through so many fucking tutorials. Every tutorial on FL Studio is ass. They take so long to get to the fucking point. If you look up like how 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 harmonies of course harmonies from scratch. From scratch, yes, from scratch. From scratch. This video is sponsored by DistroKid. If you don't know, listen to what it sounds like. Wait, it's not this, bro. <laughs> bro, this guy. This guy loves not using his own vocal. I want to create a harmony on it. Oh, and obviously really? the singer isn't here. And if oh shit, where is she at? And they create a vocal. Not in your fucking room. Not available anymore. This is a great way. Shotty saw the balloon in the background and was like, "Oh hell no!" Nah. Oh my god, go this fucking new tone. Song, but last day you see. Really dope, simple way to create your own harmony. All right, what else do we have? Jonas sh shows you how to show you guys make what this music. Song Oh, this actually sounds decent. Oh, okay, yeah, so he has them panned left to right. There's so many, there's so many fucking layers. If you need any presets, join the Discord. Oh, we got you. Bro stacked a vocal sandwich, put them on the left and right, and called that shit a day. It sounds good. It sounds good, but bro did not explain how to fucking do it. Join the Discord, please, bro. Please join the Discord. How to actually layer your vocals. Oh, Gunner, finally here to save the day. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your layer vocals go from this... But there's an option to die is to live in her For the mix itself, I'm actually using one of my vocal presets on my website, lowgunner.com. It's called Gunner. Lowgunner.com. So you can hear that one is kind of in your left ear. And then if we go to this one, kind of just panned it to the left. Uh, and oh my god, go motherfuckers and also love that, panning. Okay, ironically, I'm wasting time. The point I'm trying to make is that all these tutorials are ass. They'll never tell you how to actually make your shit sound good. So, people in these fucking tutorials just already assume you know what the fuck a harmony is. What the fuck even is that shit? Let's take a step back, shall we? We'll skip to the fu the fucking important part. So, I've already recorded this, obviously. We're gonna mute this. One thing you're gonna have to know is the difference between a harmony and an octave. So right here, I've just copied this clip and I pitch it up by 1200 cents. And this is gonna make it go one octave up. I'm not educated in fucking music, but it's always gonna be 12 semitones up or down. So here it is up. Keyboard out for this so I can kind of demonstrate. Uh, Ready, ready to go? Okay, so look, this is exactly what I'm talking about. So if we hit this C right here, right? We go 12 up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 semitones. Holy fuck. Holy shit. Holy fuck. That is what an octave is. Now the problem is you're gonna need to figure out what the harmony is. Your harmony is gonna lie anywhere in between 1 and 12 semitones. There are multiple harmonies in between. If you've ever known people who are in acapella, they can tell you 10 bajillion different harmonies there are to a single note. Finding the harmony really relies on your own skills. And it comes very naturally to some people and to others it does not. In the context of this, how can I make this make sense? <laughs> right? Then we have our higher one that's like... 
right? Then there's gotta be another one. There's definitely the possibility for another harmony. Personally, I just like to have one because it sounds cleaner. If, if you have more, that's chill too. Oh shit. Yo, what's good? No, this guy cannot be fucking serious, bro. What are you? I know you are, didn't post that fucking. Oh my god, bro. Bro, I'm what? fucked. Bro, bro what are you? You don't have to tell anyone that shit, bro. Oh, uh, are you chill? No, guy. They're using it. Dude, they're using your fucking video as evidence in court. Bro, what? Dude, my parents found out. They told my grandparents. My, they're all on my case. Oh my god, bro. Everyone fucking knows, bro. This shit is not chill. Bro, how is I sp- I'm fucking heated, bro. I'm actually fucked. I'm gonna have two DUIs now. Wait. Wait, two? Yeah. The other one's this whole other thing, but- Bro, two DUIs is so much worse than one. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Bro, you're actually such a fucking dick. I can't believe this. Bro, next time I see you, bro, you're fucking- Oh my god, bro. You don't even know what's gonna happen, bro. Bro, I'm gonna beat your fucking ass, bro. Um, bro. Alright, I'm gonna give you another example on what to do when you're making harmonies. Now, of course, this is also subjective as fuck, this is my opinion. I feel like your harmony is gonna be like extra flair added on top. If your main vocal is going crazy and your harmony is just monotone, it's gonna sound like ass. In my opinion, I'd much rather have a harmony hit more notes than my main vocal does. Where the fuck is my fucking... I'm gonna do a little fucking drawing, alright? So, we have the phrase... Bro, why the fuck? Why did, why did I do that? Make me hit the A. Alright, so if we're looking at this line and we're like, shit, I wanna harmonize. This video is gonna be fucking ass and balls and cock and tits and ass and balls. So we have poppin' and the note goes up on Anna. Anna Bean. And then it's the same. This is kind of what the main vocal would look like. This and my harmony is so on this fucking one is boring. Let's please move it. along. I hate Both this section. I want to kill myself hands. editing this. We're moving on. So anyways, you might be asking, Bazit, what the fuck? Like, what? This is not useful. I'm so good at making harmonies and shit. I just need to know how to mix them so they don't sound like cock and ball. I got you covered on that. This is the secret sauce that no one is going to tell you. Without the secret sauce, this is what it's going to sound like. Popping on a beef and a mimi at the head. It's fine. Right, it's it's good. It's whatever. It sounds like there's two vocals there. The problem that I have with this is that they clash hella. Now, basically, this is the fruity stereo enhancer. All right, oh. this is the best plugin of all time. Maybe not of all time, but it's up there. On your background track, it could honestly be just a copy paste of your main track. I, I you know what? Fuck it. Fuck this track. We're just gonna remake it from fucking from. From, uh, fucking- From scratch. Bobbing on a beat. There it is, dry. Wonderful, right? Here's the main preset. T. It could be a gunner preset for all I know. If there's not chorus already on it, you're going to want that shit. Put it on. I wouldn't ever crank it up all the way unless you hate your ears. You don't want to overdo it. I would say you don't want any more than halfway. In fact, I'm just gonna use a quarter here. This is where the sauce comes in. This bad boy looks like a piece of shit, I won't lie. Wow, there's like fucking three pan knobs. That's so awesome and stuff. Basically, what this does, I actually do know what this does. It takes the frequencies. I can't explain this fucking well at all. Anyways, it does a, like a flippity flappity thing with the frequencies, and it makes it so it is the opposite of your main vocal. Separate this from your main vocal so it doesn't clash. Now, there's all sorts of shit you can do. Like this shit. I hear no difference between any of these, so I don't really give a fuck. There's stereo separation, okay? Now, this can- this is merged, and this is separated. Whichever way you point this silly little knob, um, the vocal's gonna be more delayed on that side. So if I turn it all the way to the right- So I would never have this cranked up this high. I'd generally keep it- in between these maybe maybe in between these if you're a bit risky but i don't really give a fuck which side it's at and you can also do a bit of panning as well if you're into that i'm not super into that i think it sounds pretty sus when you pan all your shit i don't really want to pan it just in one direction and then you hear the background vocal and it's always on like the left side i think that's kind of weird but low key that might just be me because i'm just
just hella horny for balance. Like, if you give me, like, a bag of M&Ms, I'm going to eat one on each side of my teeth. And then if I get left with one left in the bag, I'm going to bite it in half and eat both sides on each side of my mouth. I do not want to hear more on one side than the other. I want it to be balanced. So, I, that's, that's why I keep it that way. But if you do want to add some panning, here's what I recommend. This is also some sauce, by the way. Here's pancake. This shit is free from Cable Guys. Cable Guys are fucking lit. We listen to this. So obviously that's a fuck ton of panning. I'll just take this and I'll just crank it down to like 10, 5, 10%. You can also adjust this to however the fuck you want. If you want it to be a little goofy spaghetti, you can have that as well. Now this is not sounding too fucking bad. Let's see how it sounds with the other vocal. Now my guess is going to be it's way too loud. And that sounds pretty fucking good. Obviously, there's no auto tune on and shit right now, but that sounds fucking good. And that is literally all you need to make a good sounding background vocal. The stereo enhancer just works hella well in all sorts of circumstances. And that would be the sauce for today, I guess. Um, uh, see ya and stuff.